The 27th of May every year has over time been set aside as Children's Day in Nigeria. On this special day, the rights of the Nigerian child are always highlighted with the aim of protecting them. In Lagos State, a special event was organized for the children at the Police College ground. Present at the event were members of the State Executive Council, stakeholders in the education sector, parents, teachers, students and pupils from schools across Lagos State. In his address, the immediate past governor of Lagos State, Mr. Babatunde Fashola, would noted that this year's Children's Day would be the last he would address the children as governor of the state, urged the children not to forget all they had been taught and all they have learned from the initiatives and innovations introduced by his administration in the last eight years. As I bid you farewell, I urge you not to forget all of the things that we have learned together, all of the things that we have done together, and all of the things that we still plan to do. Those of you in the Road Safety Club, do not forget what you have learned about road safety, about road signs, about road regulations, in order to remain safe as you walk up and down our streets across Lagos. Those of you in the Power Kids Club, do not forget what you have learned about conserving energy and saving money so that we can ultimately deliver electricity for the whole of Lagos and for the whole of Nigeria. Those of you in the Climate Change Club, do not forget what you have learned about protecting the environment, conserving water, managing your waste properly, using and reusing and recycling. Don't forget what you have learned about washing your hands regularly. That was why this state could confront and defeat Ebola, because you had imbibed the habit of cleanliness and hand washing. Don't forget that. All of you, all of us, must continue to remember that the road to success will be played by stones of hard work. We must work hard to pick up those stones and we will see success. The 2015 Children's Day in Lagos State was a fun-filled one for the children as the day was spiced up with a march passed by various voluntary organizations, cultural representations from the students and the cutting of the cake. We are the future the dream we are the nation we are part of this yes we are so amazing that's the least we shall be at the heart of the nation changing history how can they say that we are finished we have just begun when we have no dreams we are the nation we are part of this oh, oh. we are the nation we are part of this Director General Office of Education Quality Assurance, Mrs. Runke Shoyombo, in an interview with Education Report on TV, made it known that the day was indeed an interesting and eventful one. It's been a brilliant um, presentation today, particularly celebrating children, and um, I'm sure we've all enjoyed it. Children have shown quite a lot of skills, and um, I have to tell you that. Um, 
we're proud of them. They're the future leaders. And I'm so happy with the way Lagos State is actually supporting our children. Ekoni Baji. Joy Ofoche, a student of Army Cantonment Junior Secondary School, also expressed her excitement. And I feel happy about today. I feel as in this place is so interesting. It was exciting. I felt as in I felt good today when I was here. The State University of Basic Education Bob Subeb also used the Children's Day celebration as a platform to flag off the registration of early childhood care and development education and primary one pupils into the state public primary schools for the year 2015-2016 academic session. Chairman of the board, Mrs. Gbola Ondaudu, stated that according to the University of Basic Education Law, parents and guardians are enjoined to register their children and words who are five years plus into primary schools. What is significant about today is the fact that it is the commencement date for the registration of all children who are six years old or should be six years old by September 2015. Universal Basic Education Act or law enjoins all parents and guardians of all our children to make sure that they are registered into any public primary schools once they are five years plus so that by September 2015, they should be six years. One of the parents, Mrs. Favor Oluwa Fisayo, urged other parents to register their children, saying education is the best legacy to be given to a child. I came here in registration of fulfilling the law. As we all know, that our country says we should educate the children for a better future. I'm happy because I was able to bring my boy today for registration. I will encourage other parents to bring their children for registration because getting the education is the best legacy we can, we can give to them. I'm so happy. In all, the hope and aspiration of the Lagos State Government is to ensure that the future of the state is left in capable hands.